Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, good evening, guys. Do you hear me? Let me see. Yes, we do. Ah, okay, great. I thought you didn't hear me. Thank you very much for joining the class and thank you for joining on time, guys. How are you today? Fine? Hi, Carla. Hi, Amelcar. Hi, Christian. Hello, Jaime. Hello, Lisa. Hello. Hi, Hi, Maggie. Hi, Sabrina. Hi, Maria Luz. Hi, Alexandra. Welcome. Hi, Stefania. Jonathan, could you please help me uh, to put your full name? <laughs> Guys, I will go through the attendance list right now. So we can start the class. So today is Thursday, uh, Thursday the 6th, 2022, guys. Angel Estefania Marroquín Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you. Me López Pérez. Me traigo. Present. Estela Mabel Orellana del Cid. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Hello, teacher. Hello, Fátima. Thank you. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present teacher. Thank you. Jessica del Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Jonathan Alexis González Torres. Present teacher. Thank you. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Solo me ayuda Jonathan a poner todo su nombre completo, please. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Carla Elizabeth Escobar Esquivel. Present. Kenny Leset Cuellar de Barrientos. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Linda Magali García Montoya. Present teacher. Lisa del Carmen Hernández Smith Me. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Thank you, Lisa. Marcos Amilcar Mancía Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Marta Lidia Godínez. Sabrina Lizeth García Orellana. 
Present. Surma Yarita Oliva Córdoba. Present. José Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Okay, Alexandra Flores Parada. Present, Miss. Thank you. Iliana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. Present, teacher. Okay, great. All right, guys. Um, so we will go ahead and start with the class right now. Uh, let me get a second. Let me just take a look. Okay, Jonathan. Okay, so I will go ahead and share the screen and we will start with the class today, guys. Just allow me one second. Okay. Okay, so um, today guys, this is the class number seven and today we will review how to use their is and there are in questions, okay? We will go in details about the questions uh, of their is and there are. Uh, we got a reading and a speaking practice right now. We will have a conversation practice on the page 21. Do me a favor and open the page 21, please. Guys, page 20, 21. Let me share the book. Okay, page 21, page 21. Here we have the page 21, guys. All right, so we have here um, this conversation, which is Mrs. Jenner is supervisor and is supervising a new branch. And she asked about the location of the places in the branch. Okay. So let's see. I'll be Mrs. Jenner and I will ask you to help me with a conversation, guys. So let's see. Um, I will go ahead and say the first, the first uh, text, and then someone or one of you will help me to read uh, to read the the the, the to read the, the rest of the conversation. Uh, good morning, R. Sorry, I, there is a missing an E. Good morning, are you Michael Fer? No, let's see, let's, let me come back. Good morning, are you Marcos Mancia? Could you please help me with the next here? Uh, good morning, yes I am. My name is Ruth Olmos. I am the supervisor on duty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Miss Licenciada Olmos. Let's get it started. Is there a conference room in here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Uh, yes, absolutely. The conference room in the next in the next to the training room. Training 
Go. Teacher, we don't hear you. Sorry. Got it. Uh, how about lunches or recreational places? Is there a lunch? Yes, it is in front of the cafeter cafeteria inside. Wasn't me, right? <laughs> That's weird. That conversation is oh. weird, but it was you. No, it was you because it doesn't make sense that I will answer myself. So it's mm -hmm. fine. Inside the new building wind, right? Great. Thank you. Very good, Emilcar. Um, good morning. Are you Christian Lopez? Good morning. Yes, I am. My name is Ruth Olmos. I am the supervisor on duty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Miss Olmos. Let's get it started. Is there a conference running here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, absolutely. The conference room next to the training room. Got it. How about lunches or recreational places? Is there a lunch? Yes, it is from the cafeteria inside the new building wing. Very good. Great, Christian. Uh, let's see. Good morning, are you Kevin Aguilar? Present teacher. Good morning, are you Miss, are you Kevin Aguilar? Could you please continue with the conversation? Uh, uh, good morning, yes I am. My name is Ruth Olmos, I am the supervisor on duty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Mr. Mrs. Almost. <laughs> Mrs. Almost. Let's get it started. Is there a conference room in here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, absolutely. The conference room is next to the training room. Got it. How about lunches or recreational places? Is there a lunch? Yes, it is from of the cafeteria inside. The new building um, wing. What? Inside the new building wing, right? Oh, okay. okay, great. Thank you. Uh, good morning. Are you Alexandra Flores? Good morning. Are you Alexandra Flores? Let's see next. <clears throat> Good morning. Are you Sabrina Garcia? Sorry, teacher. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Sorry, Sabrina. Let's do it with Alexandra and then with Sabrina. Good morning. Are you Alexandra Flores? Good morning. Yes, I am. My, my my name is Ruth name. Olmos. Mm. Sorry, my name is Ruth Almost. I'm the supervisor on duty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Miss Miss Tisher Almost. Let's get started. Is there a conference room in here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, absolutely. I believe there is something wrong with her connection, right? Alexandra? <laughs> You're here, Alexandra. Yes, absolutely. Oh, don't worry. Here you are. Yes, absolutely. Creo que sí tienen problemas con, el, con la conexión. Sí me escucha, teacher. Ahorita sí. Ok. 
Hello. Ya no la escuché. Okay, let's continue with Sabrina. Sabrina, could you please start the conversation? Introduce mm -hmm. your name and say, and pick up another classmate. Okay. Good morning. Are you Yuri Alexandra? Yuri Flores? Yuri has problems with the internet. Ah, sorry, yes. sorry, sorry. Um, okay. Good morning. Are you Ileana Calderon? Good morning. Yes, I am. My name is Sabrina Garcia. I am I'm, I'm the supervisor on duty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Garcia, Sabrina Garcia. Sabrina. Dice, let's get started. Is there a conference room in here? And if and if so, are there enough seats for listeners? from. Got it. How about lounge or recreational place? Is there a lounge? Yes, it is long. Okay, great. Thank you, guys. Very good job. Uh, let's see. Julio, could you please help me with the conversation? And Julio and Fatima? Hello, teacher. Hello. Good morning. Are you Fatima? Good morning. Yes, I am. My name is Julio. I'm the supervisor on jury. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Julio. Let's get started. Is there a conference? I believe you continue, Julio. Is there a conference running here? And if so? Okay, let's get started. Is there a conference room in here? I am so. Are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, absolutely. The conference room in the next to the training room. Um, got it. How about lunches or recreational places? Is there a lunch? Ahí vamos, Julio. Julio? Well, lots of sign up. <laughs> Um, let's see. Okay. Great, guys. Um, let's see. I will do it with... Lisette. Okay. Good morning. Are you Lisette Hernandez? Sorry. Give me a Good morning, yes, I am. My name is Ruth Olmos. I am the supervisor on duty. Uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Ruth Olmos. Me. Let's get it started. Um, is there a conference running here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Creo que nos equivocamos, teacher. Let's do it again. Good morning. Are you Lisette 
get uh oh my god i just lost you <laughs> and i don't want to make a mistake lisette hernandez <laughs> my name is ruth almost i'm the supervisor on duty nice to meet you Nice to meet you, Mr. Ruth Olmos. Let's get it started. Is there a conference running here? And if so, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, absolutely. The conference room is the next to training room. Got it. How about the lunches or recreational places? Is there a lunch? Yes, it is in front of the cafeteria inside the new building wing. Very good, good. Okay, guys, so let's see. Um, let's go ahead and just complete the questions about the conversation and then try to go ahead and answer the, the, the questions. In that case, in the number one, what is the best answer? Marcos, Antonio? Is there or are there enough seats for listeners? Marcos? Sorry, teacher. Uh, is there? Is there enough seats for listeners or are there enough seats for listeners? Is there? What do you think? Um, let's see. Let's see. What do you think, Christian? Is is there or is are there seats enough seats for listeners? Are there? Are there? Are, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, because seats is in plural. Okay. So, guys, are there enough seats for listeners? According to the to the reading, yes or no? Are there enough seats? Are there, guys? I think it's are there enough seats for listeners? Yes, that's right. Is are there enough seats for listeners? So my question is, are there enough seats for listeners? Yes or no? Okay. How was the question? <laughs> are there enough seats for listeners? According to the reading? Yes. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, there are, right? Yes, there are. Yes, there are. Perfect. What about the number two? Is there a conference room or are there a conference room? How would I say that? Is there or are there, guys? Is there. Is there. Is there. Okay. So what do you think, guys? Is there a conference room? Yes or no? According to the reading, is there a conference room, guys? What do you think? Is, is there. Uh-huh, is there a conference room? So my question now is, is there a conference room? Yes, it is, or no, it isn't. Basado en yes, la lectura? Yes, yes, it is. It is. Yes. Yes, it is, right? Okay, great. Perfect, guys. All right, let me stop. Let me share the presentation. Sorry. Okay, guys, so we have a speaking, um, sorry, we have a listening practice. Let's listen to a conversation. And once you listen to the conversation, write um, down three sentences. 
with there is and there are, please. Write three sentences that you hear with there is or there are. If you listen to questions with there is and there are, write down the questions. If you listen an affirmative, write it down. If you listen to a negative, write it down. The purpose is that you provide me three examples about this topic in the, le in the, in the listening, okay? Is that clear, guys? Are you following me? Yes? No? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Okay, let me play the... Let me play this one moment. Give me a second. Guys, could you please let me know if you can listen to the to this audio, to the conversation? No, I'm teacher. Looking for an apartment? What about yes. now? Uh, okay, great. Okay, pay attention, guys, and take three examples, okay? Provide me three examples at the end of this conversation, okay? Write down three examples that you hear. Okay, let's play it. Are you still looking for an apartment? Yes, I am. I'm still looking. Well, there's a very nice apartment for rent in my building now. Oh, really? Tell me about it. There's a large window in the living room. Mm -hmm. And there's a big closet in the bedroom. Uh-huh. And there's a great kitchen. Is it large? Yes. There is room for a nice big table. Is there an elevator in the building? No, there isn't. But get this, there's a jacuzzi in the bathroom. You're kidding. No, I'm serious. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I'm very interested. <laughs> okay, uh, did you hear that, guys? One more. One more time? Okay, let's play. One more time. One second. Are you still looking for an apartment? Yes, I am. I'm still looking. Well, there's a very nice apartment for rent in my building now. Oh, really? Tell me about it. There's a large window in the living room. Mm -hmm. And there's a big closet in the bedroom. Uh-huh. And there's a great kitchen. Is it large? Yes. There is room for a nice big table. Is there an elevator in the building? No, there isn't. But get this. There's a jacuzzi in the bathroom. You're kidding. No, I'm serious. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I'm very interested. <laughs> Okay, did you hear that? Do you want it to do you want me to play the third time? One more time, yeah. okay? One more. One more time, okay. Are you still looking for an apartment? Yes, I am. I'm still looking. Well, there's a very nice apartment for rent in my building now. Oh really? Tell me about it. There's a large window in the living room. Mm -hmm. And there's a big closet in the bedroom. Uh-huh. And there's a great kitchen. Is it large? Yes. There is room for a nice big table. Is there an elevator in the building? No, there isn't. But get this. There's a jacuzzi in the bathroom. You're kidding. No, I'm serious. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I'm very interested. <laughs> Okay, guys, so did you get the examples? Yes. Yes. 
Great. Uh, let's see. Let me get a second. Let me go back to. Okay, could you please give me the examples? Who wants to tell me one example? Who wants to share with me one example? There is a lot of window in the living room. There is a lot of window in the living room. Very good. Another example, guys? There is a big closet in the bedroom. There is a big closet in the bedroom. Okay. Are you still looking for the apartment? Uh huh. Are you still looking for an apartment? Oh, okay. Are you still looking for an apartment? Is that a, a they are in their E? No. There, there is a very nice apartment. There is a very nice apartment. Uh huh. Fatima, this question is in present continuous, but it is it's a little bit confused because it says, Are you still looking for an apartment, right? Pero pregunta está en presente continuous, okay? Pero very good, okay? Another, another one, guys? There is a nice big table. There is a nice big table. Great. What else? There is a jacuzzi in the bedroom. There is a jacuzzi in the bathroom. Okay. What else? Not the reason when, when I think... Uh, the, the the customer make a question the seller says no there isn't no there isn't what was the question guys somebody that uh, got the question maybe did somebody get the question no no other question no okay Guys, uh, let's see. We have another practices regarding questions, okay? Let me get a second. I have another conversation about uh, questions. You will notice the difference. One moment. Let me share the screen again and the sound and we will listen to another conversation. Okay, and this conversation is about just questions. Questions, so write down the questions, okay? Write down the questions. Allow me just a second. I believe I have already shared the sound, okay. Okay, let's listen to you. Is there a stove in the kitchen? Yes, there is. There's a very nice stove in the kitchen. Oh, good. Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? No, there isn't. Oh, I see. Tell me, how many bedrooms are there in the apartment? There are two bedrooms in the apartment. Two bedrooms? Yes, that's right. And tell me, are there many closets in the apartment? Yes, there are. There are three very large closets. Oh, good. And are there washing machines in the building? No, there aren't. But there's a laundromat around the corner. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I am. Good. Sorry, guys. Uh, did you hear that? Do you want me to play it again? Yeah, play it again. Great. Please. One second. Is there a stove in the kitchen? Yes, there is. There's a very nice stove in the kitchen. Oh, good. Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? No, there isn't. Oh, I see. Tell me. How many bedrooms are there in the apartment? There are two bedrooms in the apartment. Two bedrooms? Yes, that's right. 
And tell me, are there many closets in the apartment? Yes, there are. There are three very large closets. Oh, good. And are there washing machines in the building? No, there aren't. But there's a laundromat around the corner. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I am. Good. Let me play it the third time, okay? Is there a stove in the kitchen? Yes, there is. There's a very nice stove in the kitchen. Oh, good. Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? No, there isn't. Oh, I see. Tell me, how many bedrooms are there in the apartment? There are two bedrooms in the apartment. Two bedrooms? Yes, that's right. And tell me, are there many closets in the apartment? Yes, there are. There are three very large closets. Oh, good. And are there washing machines in the building? No, there aren't. But there's a laundromat around the corner. Are you interested in the apartment? Yes, I am. Good. Okay, guys. So, let's go ahead and see this uh, examples that you got from the listening. Those were some of them questions and some of them regular sentences, negative and affirmative. Let's see. Um, Lisa, do you have one example? Yes. There are two bedrooms in the apartment. There are two bedrooms in the apartment. Very good. Kevin, do you have another another sentence, another example? Kevin? Uh, Ms. Stefania? Kevin, Ms. Stefania, are you there? Okay, so who wants to uh, participate? Example is like there that. is there a stove in the kitchen? Is there a stove in the kitchen? Uh huh. Very good. Another example. Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? Very good. Another example, guys. There are three very large clothes in the apartment. Uh huh. There are three very large. Closets in the apartment, right? Yes. Very good. What else? How many bedrooms are there? How many bedrooms are there in? Uh huh. Very good. What else? Are there washing machines in the building? Mm hmm. Are there washing machines in the building? Mm -hmm. What else? Another example? Are there many closets in the apartment? <laughs> Are there many closets in the apartment? Good job. Okay, another one? Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? Is there a refrigerator in the kitchen? Very good. Great. Perfect. The last one? Last example? Another one you may have, guys? No more examples? Okay, thank you very much. You did an amazing job, guys. Let's continue them with the class. Um, let's see. 
Now, guys, uh, since today we are having uh, this topic for questions, today we will go ahead and focus on the questions, guys. Remember, in the questions, let me go ahead and hit this. Okay, in the questions, whenever we are talking about a singular form, we ask, is there, is is there okay whenever we're talking about plural we say are there is there are there okay is there are there in order to answer the questions guys we say no there isn't or yes it is all right no there isn't or yes it is if we are about to answer a plural form we say yes there are or we say no there aren't yes there are no there aren't okay that's the way of answering a yes no question but if you want to answer a wh questions the 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 question will be how many how many are there okay how many trees are there how many, uh, let's see, how many trees, how many cats are there? Okay, that's the way of doing it. And the answer can vary. La, 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 la respuesta va a variar. Porque puede hacer que le están preguntando cuántos, pero si usted solamente tiene uno, you said there is just one tree. Okay. Si a usted le pregunta con, con el are there, no necesariamente usted va a responder con el there are, porque va a depender de su respuesta. Si usted solamente tiene uno, usted solamente va a decir there is. There is a cat, there are two cats, etc. ¿Ok? Pero con el yes no question, usted responde yes, there is. Yes, there are. No, there isn't. No, there aren't. ¿Ok? Pero con la WH question, usted ya hace la oración completa y usted dice, there is uh, one tree, there are five trees, etc. Okay, that's the way of answering a yes no question and a WH question. Okay, we have this exercise, but before going to this exercise, guys, I will ask you to please do me a favor and we will practice a conversation. We will make a conversation right now. It's similar to the listening practice that we have got, okay? Vamos a hacer una conversation in which you are renting an apartment, okay? You are providing the description of the apartment and the other person is asking questions as well using their is and their are, okay? Let's go ahead and try to make a short conversation. Okay, a short conversation using there is and there are. It should be similar to the be, to the listener, uh, to the listening, okay? Tiene que ser similar al listen, a listening que escuchamos ahorita. Um, let's see. I just want to make sure who is who are the listeners right now. Jaime Carla, Luis, Yarixa, Jonathan y Mabel. ¿Todavía están de listeners todos? No, yo, yo ya no tengo. Ya estoy. Yo ya no Great, okay. perfect. Ok, entonces vamos a hacer los pairs. Vamos a hacer los pairs right now, guys. Y vamos a hacer una conversación similar al, 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 al listener. Al listening, sorry. Que tuvimos ahorita. Ok. So let me get a moment and let me open the breaker rooms. Let me assign to you manually so we can work in this conversation. Ustedes van a crear la conversación utilizando there is and there are. Asking questions. Remember, you are renting an apartment and the other person is a customer trying to get the apartment, trying to rent the apartment, okay? So questions about this conversation, guys? Questions? Is that clear? Okay, so let me. Assign to the groups, okay? Click on join guys, please click on join.
Click on join, guys. <laughs> no aparece, teacher. Eh, click on join. No le aparece. Oh, no, no, no. Es que todavía no lo ha asignado usted, Marcos, ahorita. Deme un segundo. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Vaya, ahora sí. Carla. Luis. Uh, let's see, Kenny, click on join, please. Uh, who else? Iliana, Marcos, click on join. Iliana, please, click on join. Hello, Mariela. Hello, Mariela. Mucho gusto de conocer. Está bien, mucho gusto de conocer. Vamos a ir a visitar unos apartamentos. Ah. Conocerle, vamos a ir a visitar unos apartamentos. Uh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hello, primero, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you.
Me, luego. There are three persons in the apartment. Y luego usted me puede decir algo como... Um, is there... A big kitchen? Is there a big kitchen in the apartment? Mm -hmm. Is there a, yes. big, yeah. a big kitchen? In the apartment? Right. Y yo le puedo responder, yes, there is. Yes, there is. Entonces, ya como para finalizar, podemos decir, ok. Eh, en hija. En Santa Tecla. Eh, podría de preguntarle, can you tell me more information? Que si puede dar más información. ¿O qué le parece? Sí. Y ahí este, usamos y ahí usamos la la, la demás, perdón. Mm. De there is y there are. Por ejemplo, sí, antes de contestarme que si está sí. disponible, pregúnteme mi nombre. Sí, Marco. Hi, uh -huh. hi, hi, my name is. Uh -huh. Sí, porque yo le, yo le diría, well, hi, good morning, I am America. What's your name? Good evening, ¿verdad? Porque estamos. Sí. En... Ah, sí, de noche. Good evening. Y ahí me va a preguntar mi nombre. Sí. Uh, what's your name? Yo le contesto, my name is Marta. Ah, pues sabe qué voy a hacer. Uh -huh. Entonces le voy a preguntar, primero voy a decir, hello, I am calling about the apartment for friends. Uh -huh. Entonces ahí ya solo yo le preguntaría el nombre, Hi, good evening. Y de ahí uh, le voy a hacer la pregunta. ¿Y is still a, a, cómo se dice había available? Como que está uh -huh. disponible. Available, creo. Uh, available. Available. Ajá. Available. Okay. Uh -huh. Y es still teacher. Uh, ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Is it still available? Si es uno, is it still available? Si está todavía still disponible. Available. Available. Okay. It is still available. Still available. Uh -huh. Exactly. Good. Entonces, ahí me contesta usted, Marcos. Yes. ¿Qué me diga? ¿Qué? Yes. Yes, it is, ¿verdad? Okay. Are there are there a TV in your house? TV. Yes, yes there are. Uh, Is there uh, a TV? Sorry. Sorry to interrupt you. Is there a TV? Or are there TVs? Are there TVs? Mm -hmm. Are there TVs in your house? Uh, the, the answer teacher is is there. Yes, uh, yes depends. There it's, it, is, it depends on how many TVs you have, Marcos. If you have one, you said there is a TV. Oh, sorry. But is it are there TV? So you said mm, no, there aren't, or yes, there there are. Yes, there are. Mm -hmm. 
I I I said I have a uh, two TV. I have two TVs. Or you can answer there are two TVs. There are two there TVs. Are. Uh -huh. Para utilizar la estructura, right? Pero usted también puede decir I have two TVs. Ah, no puedo utilizar ese, 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 ese verbo. Los dos. Los dos son, los dos se pueden utilizar, Marco. Pero como el propósito es utilizar el there are, ocupemos el there are. <laughs> you can say there ah. are two TVs. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Pero también okay. puedes decir I have two TVs. También se puede hacer eso. Ay, estoy sí. entiendo mejor. <laughs> ok, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Ok, eh... Is there um is there a uh, uh, a kid song in your bedroom? No. Excuse me. Repeat, please. Bedroom. Hello. Hello. Repeat. Comfortable. 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 Eh, puedo poner, allí lo voy a poner yo como decir mal. Is so comfortable. 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 Mm -hmm. comfortable. Mm -hmm. Que es cómodo. Ah, cómodo. Yes, that's right. Comfortable. Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. Comfortable. Vale, usted puede hacer otra pregunta si tenemos otra cosa ahí. Yo le voy a poner en. Excelente, le voy a poner excelente, 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 eh, y no pregunta, sino que puede ser como la misma observación del... Are you interested in the new apartment? In this yes, yes, yeah, I am, in, oh. I am. Oh, okay, let me show this apartment, here we are. Okay, I need in the apartment. In the apartment, is there a big room? Yes, there is. Mm, is there a lot of bathroom? Yes, the apartment has two bathrooms. Great. Okay, is there a view in the apartment? Yes, there is. Uh, this apartment has a beautiful view in the window. Oh, nice. Mm, tell me more about the apartment. Okay, very good. Uh, uh, let me show. This apartment has two rooms. There is one kitchen and there is a living room. And last, there is a watching room. Are you interested yet in the apartment? Yes, I'm very interested. I love the apartment. Okay, congratulations. If, if you want the apartment, it's your about now. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you're very welcome. Sorry guys that I I I close the 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 breaker rooms, but it's time to go and pass that list. 
All right, so you can go ahead and, and, and do it the way you have it, okay? Don't worry, guys. So let me go through the attendance list really quick. Guys, thank you very much. Uh, Ileana Calderón, Ileana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. Present teacher. Judy Alexandra Flores Parada. Uh, Jose Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Zulma Yarixa Oliva Córdoba. Present. Sabrina Lizette García Orellana. Present. Marta Lidia Godínez. Present, teacher. Uh, Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Present, teacher. Great. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Present teacher. Carlos Amilcar Mancía Gutiérrez. Uh, present teacher. Ya me cambió el nombre, teacher. Name. Sorry, sorry. Marcos Amilcar Mancía Gutiérrez. Present teacher. ¿Y cómo le dije? Carlos. <laughs> Carlos. Pero me puso really? Carlitos. <laughs> La, el de Rug, Ruglats, ¿cómo es? Ah, sí. Ajá. A la aventura en pañales, no, no. Ajá, Luis Ajá. Ernesto Gómez García. Ah, Luis del Carmen Hernández, Miss Me. Present. Linda Magali García Montoya. Present. Present teacher. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Kenny Lizeth Cuer de Barrientos. Kevin Alexander y Kenny Lizeth. Present teacher. Ok. Uh, Carla Elizabeth Escobar Esquivel. Present. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Jonathan Alexi González Torres. Present teacher. Jessica del Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present teacher. Estela Mabel Oriana del CIP. Present. Cristian José López Pérez. Present. Ángel Estefanía Marroquín Martínez. Okay, guys, so thank you very much. Now let's go ahead and make the role plays. Who wants to start with the role play? A volunteer. Is there wearing an orange blouse or an orange, orange t-shirt or shirt? No, right? What about black color? <laughs> I'm wearing black. Uh, let's see, who has glasses? <laughs> who has glasses on? Fatima, Mabel, and Julio. Fátima, Mabel, and Julio. Marcos Antonio, choose one of them. Mabel, Fátima, or Julio. Choose one. Eh, Fátima. Ah, mire, Fátima la tiene con tu <laughs> <laughs> No, mentiras. <laughs> ok, Fátima. <laughs> Who's your partner? <gasps> Ay, Mabel. Mabel. <laughs> ok, let's do it, girls. Thank you, Marco. Por eso me reí. <laughs> ah, ok. Ok. Este... ¿Qué sé yo? Inicio usted. Good morning. Good morning. Can I help you? Do you have any house to rent? Yes, I do. There is any house in Santa Tecla. Could you give me more information, please? 
Sure. There is a bathroom. There are three bedrooms. There is a living. There is a dining room. And there is a garage. We finished. <laughs> Okay, great. Thank you very much. Good job. Okay, Fatima, could you please choose another person? Christian. Hi, Marcos. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought you was going to be choosing. Um, no. <laughs> okay, Christian, go for it, Christian. Thank you, Fatima. Thank you, Mabel. Good job. Okay. With my, with my partner is Jonathan. Okay. Where is, oh, okay. I want to start. Hi, mister. Hello. Nice to meet you. My name is Jonathan. I am you. Nice to meet you too. I am Christian. Ah, ah. Oh, Christian. Are you, are you interested in the new apartment in this building? Yes, I am. Oh, very good. Let me show this apartment. Here we are. I need the apartment. Is there a big room? Yes, there is. Mm, is there a lot of bathroom? Yes, the apartment has two bathrooms. Mm, for me, it's okay. Is there a view in the apartment? Oh, very good, yes. There is some beauty view in the windows. What do you think? Mm, for me it's okay, but tell me, tell me more about the apartment. Oh, Christian, okay, let me see. Uh, this apartment has two rooms, there is one kitchen, and there is some living room. And the last, there is some watching room. Are you interested in the apartment yet? Yes, I'm very interested. I love the apartment. Okay, very good. If you want the apartment, it's your about now. Okay, thank you, Jonathan. Congratulations, nice to meet you. That's a good seller, right? <laughs> Congratulations, you got the apartment. <laughs> Very good, <laughs> great. <laughs> a good seller. Hmm. <laughs> I am seller, teacher. I'm uh -huh, sorry. You are seller. <laughs> you cannot avoid doing this. <laughs> I know that feeling. I know that feeling. <laughs> it's it's really good. You get customers like he's, that, right? He's a, Christian is a good customer, right? Do you believe that? Ah, no, <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, great. Good job, guys. So, uh, Jonathan, could you please choose the next person? Oh, uh, let me see. Um, let me see. Uh, So, uh, Carla Elizabeth. Carla, oh, Carla is today a listener. She's a listener okay, today. Okay, let me see another person. Uh, what do you think about Julio Cesar Ramirez, right? You too? Yes, Julio. Okay, let's do it, Julio. Julio and Sabrina, right? Yes. Okay, let's do it. Okay. It say, I your quarter. Are you, Julio, are you still looking for apartment? Yes, I am. There are new apartments. Are you interested? Yes, I am. How many bedrooms are in the apartment? There are three bedrooms in the apartment. Is there a big stick in the apartment? Yes, there is. I will contact you tomorrow. Okay. Finish. I, I okay, am a bad great. seller. <laughs> mm. Okay, okay. What do you think, Jonathan? Ah. Jonathan is the supervisor on duty today. <laughs> <laughs> About the sellers here. <laughs> no, that, good job, good job. <laughs> ya escucharon el, el musicón que tiene Sabrina. 
<laughs> Sorry, it's because my father is is listening to music. He really? always listen to music uh, this time. Really? Yes. There was yes. a there was a music, there was a song. Sorry, I believe it was Cor. Cor oh my, Reina, como es Cornelio Reina, right? Cornelio yes, Reina. <laughs> <laughs> that one yes. caught my attention. She, he listened to music when he can't sleep. Oh, really? Yes. That's a good music. Okay, let's see. Let's do it, sorry. <laughs> already done, sorry. Ah, uh, Julio, <laughs> choose the next person, please. <laughs> Estela Mabel. Okay, Mabel. Oh, she already passed. Mabel and Fatima. Another person, yeah. Julio? <laughs> eh, Marco Antonio. Yes. Ah, mentiras. <laughs> Thank you, Julio. <laughs> y Marcos, like. Está <laughs> teacher, <laughs> Ah? I'm just kidding. You know that I'm teasing you, Marcos. Yes. Yes. Así como que, yes. <laughs> Es que, es que igual este, la compañera como, como que acababa de entrar, entonces este, no mucho le entendimos. Ah, ¿cómo así? Yo lo escuché Ajá, practicar, sí. guys. Bueno. ¿Qué es lo que Hola, tiene Marcos? Ahorita? Marcos. ¿Hola? Las mismas preguntas, ¿verdad? Yeah, ah, okay. do what you have. Hagan lo que tienen. Don't worry. Be happy. Okay. Hello, Marcos. Hello, Kenny. I have a question for you. Are there um, are there TVs in your house? Uh, yes, there is. Are there? Are there TVs in your house? No, no, there, no, there aren't. No, there aren't. I don't know. <laughs> there are TVs. I don't know if there are TVs in your house. <laughs> Teacher, es que teníamos una duda con, con ah, okay. Marco. Ah, dígame. Eh, y yo le hago una pregunta en eh, plural, uh -huh. pero él quiere responder que solo tiene uno, no, no muchos, no más de uno. Si le hago la pregunta en plural, ¿él tiene que responder en singular o tiene que hacer la negación en plural y decir después la afirmación con, en singular? Mm, that's an interesting question. Uh, so your question is, are there TV? Mm -hmm. No, there aren't. Si en caso no tuviera, ¿verdad? O puede decir, yes, there is one TV. Yes, there okay. is one TV in, the, in my house. Aunque, ajá, aunque yo le haga pregunta en plural, la respuesta mm -hmm. de tiene que ser en base a lo que tiene, ¿verdad? Exactly. Que tiene. Exactly. Okay. Good. Hello, teacher. I'm here. <laughs> Thank you, Amilcar, for your, for your time. <laughs> Thank you for your effort. Pues sí, ¿qué estaba diciendo de Amilcar usted, Marcos? No, que no ha participado. <ríe> Ay, no, men <ríe> mentiras, Amilcar, no ha hablado ah, de bueno. usted. <ríe> Estoy me... bromeando. <ríe> y me bien imaginé. cabal responde. Él. Me Mira, tan bello, tan bello, Marcos, por no dejarme así, bien le responde. <ríe> no, no ha dicho nada, Amilcar, ok. I'm just kidding. <ríe> ok, let's continue with the conversation, guys. Sorry. Okay. Entonces, um, Marcos, are there TVs in your house? No, 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 there, no, there aren't. Is, is there a one TV? I think I said, sorry, Marcos. Um, yes, there is one TV in my house. Yes, ah. there is one TV. Okay. Yes, there is a one TV in my house. Okay. Uh, there is closet in your bedroom. Is there a closet in your bedroom? Is there? 
It's there, sorry. Uh -huh. It's there <laughs> the closet in your bedroom. No, there is. No, there is. No, there isn't. No, there isn't. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ask question for me, please. Ask questions, Marcos. Oh. Is there is there a pet in your house? Yes, there is. There is a dog. Okay, there, there are a car in your garage. Is there are a there. car? Is there a car, Marcos? Is, is there a car? Is there a car? In your garage? In your question. garage. Mm -hmm. The question, Marcos, are there? Si es en plural, are there? Are there cars in your garage? O si no, is there a car in your garage? Okay, uh, is there a computer? Yes, there is. Yes. Okay. Okay, okay let's speak to Kenny. Bye. Ay, Marcos. Good night, Marcos. Ay, Marcos. Very good, guys. No, it's fine. You know what? I really like that you learn. Okay, you learn in the process. Okay, very good. So, Kenny, choose another person, please. Uh, Marcos. Amilka. Uh, Amilka, yes. <laughs> okay. Hey, Marcos, I am again, teacher. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, Nisho. Okay. <laughs> Hello, I am calling about the apartment for rent. Uh, hello, uh, hi, good evening. I am Amilcar. Uh, what's your name? My name is Marta. It is, is still available? Yes, it's available. It's available. It like to see it where the apartment located. Yes, it's located in San Salvador Dow Town. Okay. Is there a large kitchen? Yes, there is. Thanks for the for the information. You're welcome. I really like your question, Marta. <laughs> is there a large kitchen? <laughs> That's something that really matters in the house. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Very good. Okay, great job. Marta, who's next? Okay. Mm. Fatima Denise. Fatima already passed. Miren como la quieren, Fatima. Y también a Mabel. Las dos ya la eligieron como okay. dos veces. <laughs> okay, no, it's fine, Marta. Another one, who's missing? Lisette. Del Carmen. Uh -huh. Very good. Lisa is missing. Okay. My partner is Mariela. Are you here? Yes. Okay. okay. Hello, Mariela. Today we're going to visit some apartments. Hi, Lisette. Nice to meet you. Yes, I am going to visit them. I hope with a ring soon. Um, okay, this is the first apartment. There are a lot of windows, so there is uh, plenty of natural light. Do you like this apartment? Yes, how many bedrooms are there in apartment? There are two bedrooms. In each room, there is a bathroom, a one bathroom. It's so comfortable. Excellent. There is a bath 
bathroom in the maid bathroom? Yes, there is. So, are you interested in this apartment? Yes, I am interested. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you. Okay, I, can, I, I call you. <laughs> we finish. Great, sorry that I interrupted. Great job. Guys, just remember at the moment of asking questions, we say, are there? Or is there? Okay. Are there? Is there? Are there? Is there? Is there anyone that is missing, guys? Falta alguien? I believe there's no one missing. More. Uh, Iliana, Carolina. Iliana, con quién iba Iliana? O oh, no? No estuvo con nadie. No estaba practicando con alguien. Nobody else is missing, guys. De los que están a. Uh, eh, Participando activos en la clase, no, no, other, no other uh, pair, no other pending pair. Todos pasaron, okay. Let's continue then with the class, guys. All right, and congratulations, okay. The more that you practice, the more that you know, okay. The more you master a topic, guys. So great. Let me go ahead and share the screen and we will continue with the class. Okay, so guys, uh, we have these this discussions right now. This is what we will do. We will go ahead and practice with your partner um, some questions. I will go ahead and give you the questions based on the list. Le voy a ir dando las preguntas que le van a ir haciendo a sus parejas basado en la lista based on your list I will give you two questions okay le voy a dar dos preguntas a cada uno para que la hagan a sus partners just give me a moment and I will look here in the break rooms okay let me see I will go ahead and start with Julio <clears throat> Voy a compartir estas dos imágenes al grupo ahorita. Let me share the screen, uh, the photo, I mean the screens, the screenshot, ok? Y solamente copien, guys, o vean qué número de pregunta es la que usted va a tener. Y esa es la pregunta que usted le va a hacer a su partner, ok? Sorry que I, I stopped sharing, pero le voy a compartir las imágenes. Verifiquen cuál es su pregunta. Yo le voy a ir dando el número de pregunta que usted va a hacer. Acuérdense que hay dos, dos imágenes. So, le puedo poner, le puedo decir eh, imagen A o imagen B y le puedo dar el, el número de preguntas. Por ejemplo, digamos que a Julio yo le voy a dar, eh, en la imagen A le voy a dar la 1 y la 2. Entonces, Julio va a hacerle esas preguntas a su compañero. Esas dos preguntas. Luego, la siguiente persona le voy a dar la 3 y la 4 y así sucesivamente, para que no se repitan. No sé si estamos bien con eso, guys. Todo va a ser speaking, ¿ok? Se van a ir para los breaker rooms y usted le va a hacer esas preguntas a su compañero. The classmate will answer. Once the classmate answer, you will ask the question. Después que usted responda sus, las preguntas, usted va a hacer sus dos preguntas también. Al final van a ser cuatro por cada pareja. Dos va a preguntar usted y dos va a responder. ¿Ok? Ya se las voy a ir asignando a cada uno. Solo le voy a mandar las imágenes. Vaya. Vale. Ahí se las mandé, guys. All right, let's start with Julio. Julio, um, your questions are uh, picture A. Picture A, la primera, donde dice student A. Este es picture A. Number one and number two, Julio, okay? One and two, picture eight. And Sabrina. Sabrina, you have, siempre en la picture A, 
you have number three and number four. La pregunta número tres y la número cuatro. Donde me... dice about how many. Yes, let me share no. the screen. Ahorita les comparto la pantalla. Okay, here you have. Okay, let me see. I'm looking to this. Teacher, um, but in the group, you are sending the, the same picture. The same letter picture. A and letter A. Really? Oh my God. Really? <laughs> okay, sorry. Ahorita les mando la otra. Thank you. One second. Thank you, Christian. Okay. Ya le voy a borrar una. Aquí me amo. Okay. El muñequito parece el profesor de las chicas super poderoso, mm -hmm. ¿verdad? Yes. What his name? Profesor. Ah. ¿Cómo así? I don't even remember. Okay. Ya las. Ya lo corregí. Thank you, guys. Okay. Let me go back. Here, right? Ok, voy a ir seleccionando las que ya están dados, las que las preguntas que están dadas. So, do, this is Julio, ok, and those are Sabrina, Sabrina. Then, let's go with Estela, ok, Estela, we go with number five and number six, five and six, Estela. Ok, teacher. Mabel, and Fátima, you go with seven and eight. Let's see, Zulma, no, Zulma Jerix is not. Christian and Jonathan. Christian, you go with nine and ten, okay? And uh, Jonathan, you go with the letter B. Letter one B, two. one and two. Mm -hmm. Letter B, one and two. And then we go with Lisette and Marielos. Lisette and Marielos. Lisette goes with the number three and four. And five and six, Marielos. Five and six. And a letter B, acuérdense, letter B. Luego vamos con Iliana, sorry, Kenny y Marcos, right? Kenny, seven and eight. And Marcos, nine and ten. ¿Hay alguien a quien no le ha asignado, guys? ¿Todos tenemos? Yes, no? Yes, right? Okay, I will open the breakout rooms, guys. Go to your breakout rooms and ask the questions and answer the questions, okay? Ask and answer the questions correctly, okay? Si su compañero se equivoca, corríjalo. Dígale, oh, en ese caso tenés que responder así, dígale. Y le dice cómo, okay? So let's go to the breakout rooms, guys. Le voy a... a question. Tell me. Uh, me is the letter B, uh, nine and ten. Yes. Um, Le asigné a usted. No me oí. Ah, pues no. <laughs> Vaya, vámonos con la una yes. y la dos. De la Marcos página. Amilcar, uh, nine and ten. Sí, right? Yes. Nine and ten. Ah, sí, ok. Nine and ten. Va con Marta, right? Okay, let's do it, guys. Click on join, pero ustedes no tienen room. Lo voy a asignar ahorita porque se me salieron. Bye. Ya los asigné. Click on join. Um... Click on join, guys. Hágame el favor de click on join.
click on join. Uh, let's see who's missing. Ileana Carolina, click on join. Teacher. Yes. Eh, es de practicar, ¿verdad? O es de agregarle algo a las, a las oraciones, la, a las preguntas. En la 10 creo que sí. Eh, let's see. Es que no, creo que no les asigné, guys. Ajá, es que mencionó do, dos veces eh, marcos. Entonces yo pensé, ¿será que tiene dos marcos? Dijo, porque le mencioné primero la... <ríe> la siete, marcos. But, ok, no, sorry. Vámonos entonces ustedes, guys. Eh, con la con la letter A con la primera student A Mar, uh -huh. uh, Marta usted va a decir con la number one and two en Marcos number two and three uh -huh. ay, 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 ya me perdí teacher y en eh, ahorita le comparto sí, ahorita ¿cuál me asignó a mí? ahorita ahorita le, le comparto thank you uh -huh. ok here you will work on Um, this one and this one, Marta, one and two. Right, one and two. And Marcos, three and four. Three and four, okay. Three and four. De la imagen dos, ¿verdad? Yes, uh, no, de la imagen dos. No, de la A, de la primera. Ah, mi choca, entonces, mm -hmm. okay, one, two. Mm -hmm. Y la, perdón, teacher, y la dinámica es, esas preguntas que me tocaron a mí, se las pregunto a, uh -huh. a Marco. Exactly. Y las que me tocaron a él, me las uh -huh. pregunté. Exactly. Using the there is and there are. Uh -huh. okay. okay, let's do it, guys. If you have any question, let me know, okay? Okay, teacher, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, guys. ¿Cuáles son las que le asignaron, Marcos? La 3 and 4. Ah, la, la segunda. Eh, siempre de la, de la misma. Ajá. Eh, por decirlo así, la mía es about how many countries are there in the world. Okay. Uh -huh. On your desk. Perdón. Is there a book on your desk? Oh, no, isn't. No, there isn't. No, there isn't. Okay. How many chairs are there in the classroom? We don't have. <laughs> uh <-huh>. um. <coughs> there, there are current chairs. In There are in charts. Mm -hmm. Parece gatito. Me lo siento, mira qué chillón es, perdón. <laughs> mira. There is a near mm -hmm. my home. Mm -hmm. Tengo que completarla, vean. Yes. That I like very much. There, that I like. Near, there is a. Mm -hmm. It's just to near. practice, guys. Practice. Ah, both of you. Uh -huh. We practice. don't have to answer. No. Only on the practice. practice. Uh -huh. It's like an interview. You answer. I mean, you ask Christian, and you and and you answer. I mean, ask and answer questions. It's like an interview. No, I don't understand. Es como una um, entrevista, verdad? Que se están haciendo. Usted yeah, for example, for example, in the night, in the number nine, uh, Christian said, uh, if uh, there are any movies, and I am, um, I am answering that is it has a uh, one movie. Which number? Sorry, what uh, number is it? Mister Stranger. <laughs> oh my God! What number is it? What number of the of the? Ah, okay, question? okay. Number nine in the starting A. Nine. Are there any good movies playing a movie theater now? Uh-huh. 
Based on and, their... I have to, and I have to answer that question or only no. Yes, you have to answer it like if you are okay, we will have a discussion right now. Vamos a hacer una discusión. Como que Christian, hey Christian, ¿sabes si yeah. hay alguna película oh. ahorita en estreno? Oh, yeah. I understand. O sea, but the number is like a topic for the conversation. Yes, it's just for you to make conversation. Okay. You don't need oh, to okay. you don't need to write it down, just answer them. Ah, okay, mm -hmm. yeah. Based on your personal talk. experience, based but, on your personal experience or based on what is happening now? Yeah, but I don't understand the, the question 10 in the same case. Mm -hmm. Let me see. It says, finish the sentences. And the sentences say, there is a near my home that I like very much. Um, you will just finish the sentence. I mean, solamente va a finalizar esa, esa pregunta. Like, for example, uh, es como un, 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 un juego que estemos haciendo ahorita. Okay, uh, Christian will say to you, Jonathan, finish this sentence. Which one? Uh, there is, let me read it, because I don't have it. There is a near my home that I like very much. Okay, finish. For example, uh, for uh, there example, is a car. Play, uh, uh, uh -huh, or um, play a stadium. For soccer stadium, for example. I don't know that game, Jonathan. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know it. But I, oh, for me, it's, it's like. <laughs> but I think Christian likes soccer. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. But okay, you will just ask and answer questions. The questions okay, I already okay. gave it to you. Mm -hmm. okay, That's teacher. it, guys. Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank practice, you, thank just you. practice. Okay. You're welcome, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, Christian. Uh, uh, one more time. Uh, there are 12 months in one year. We finished, teacher. Great, did you practice? Yes. Okay, great. <laughs> Uh, let me go ahead and check in the other groups, okay? Thank you, guys. Okay. Thank you a lot. In English alphabet. In mm -hmm. English alphabet. alphabet. Okay. Ask me questions. Uh, listen, if here a pen on your desk. On your desk. Yes, in my desk. Uh, in my desk, there are a lot of pens. A lot of pens. Okay, okay. How many windows are there going to? No, no, Eso there, entiendo, is, there is a, a volleyball. There is a, yeah. a park. Uh, yes. Y en la siguiente dice, de las mías dice, how many pictures are there on this paper? Su respuesta tiene que decirme siete. In, the, in your answer. La ocho le estoy haciendo, Mark. The number eight. How many pictures are there in this paper, on this paper? Yes, there, yes, there, there are. No, um, la respuesta sería Marco, how many? How many? I how mean, le está preguntando how many. How many uh, pictures are on the paper? Busque el papel donde están haciendo las preguntas y cuántas imágenes hay ahí. Acuérdese que la esa es una WH question. How many? Y cuando haya una W una WH question, usted va a responder con una uh, valga la redundancia respuesta larga, ¿sí? una oración completa. Pero si le hacen una yes no question, va a ser una oración corta. 
¿sí? Son como las preguntas abiertas y las preguntas cerradas. Es como que yo le diga, hey Marcos, ¿hay animales en su casa? Entonces usted va a decir, oh, no, no hay, sí, sí hay. Pero si yo le digo, ¿cuántos animales tiene? Usted va a decir, ah, hay cinco animales. Entonces siempre confirmemos qué tipo de pregunta nos están haciendo para responder. ¿Ok? Ok, entonces ahí tendría que ser, are there... There are. there are, porque es respuesta. Uh, there are seven pictures. Mm -hmm. Seven pictures, yes. Exactly. Okay. Okay. In your uh, question, the number nine, si esa sí sería cerrada. Mm -hmm. La mía, sí. Mm -hmm. are there Something to do in your town or city? Yes, there are. Y ahí se me pregunta what? ¿Qué? What? ¿Qué verdad? Yeah, for example, um, going to cinema. Or, y ahí cómo sería, teacher? ¿Qué número? What number? Let's see, no, no, you have no. seven and eight, right? Nine, nine, nine. number nine. Number yeah. nine. Are there any fun things to do in your home, in your town or city? Eso, ok. ¿Quién se lo hace, Marcos? Marcos. Marcos, pero yo no escuché que usted se le hiciera a, a Kenny. Acuérdense que yes. es como una discusión, ¿sí? Que usted se va a hacer, usted le va a hacer preguntas. Es como que, ok, Kenny, eh, ¿hay algún lugar para, para, para divertirnos ahí donde usted vive, en su pueblo? Oh, yes, there is a bar close to the, close to the, close to the park. I don't know. Oh, you can say, oh, no, okay. there is no, no, no fun places there. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Marcos. Okay. Are there any fun things to do in your town or city? Yes, there are. Um, there are parks there are uh, cinemas there are um, plazas comerciales no sé cómo se dice I don't know uh, places uh, no sé comercial Hello, hello. Hello, guys. Thank you for joining. Okay, guys. So there are missing 10 minutes. We will work on the course book right now. 
Let me get just one moment, please. Okay, guys, let me share the screen. Let's go ahead and just review some answers here, guys. Um, if I ask you how many people there are there in your family, in that case, if this is an open question or if this is a WH question, guys, the answer will be there are let's say five people in my, in my family, okay? Pero si le hacen una, una eh, pregunta cerrada o una yes, no question, si le dicen, is there a good restaurant near your school, your school or college? college, college sorry, uh, you will answer uh, yes. Yes, there is or no, there aren't. I mean, no. Yes, there is or no, there isn't. Dependiendo, ¿verdad? La respuesta también va a ser, eh, dependiendo de, de, de lo que usted, de su experiencia, así va a ser la respuesta. Ok, ¿sí? Entonces, recuérdense que con how many usted va a responder there is or there are, pero va a ser una respuesta completa, mientras que con el yes, no question va a ser unas preguntas cerradas. Eh, respuestas cerradas, como por ejemplo, no, there isn't, uh, no, there aren't, yes, there is, yes, there, there are, ok. No sé si tenemos preguntas al respecto, guys. No. Ok, so guys, this is the last exercise, go to the page 22, ok, on your book, page 22. Okay, here. Uh, in the page 22, guys, here we have to write the question that correspond, that correspond to the answer that follows. Use the words in parentheses. Compare your answers with classmates. For example, in the number one, is there a conference room in your company? You will have just the answers. Solamente tienen the answers here. Your job is to make the questions, okay? Based on the answer, you will make the question. For example, in the number one, is there a conference room in your company? Where did I take conference room from? I took conference room from the parentheses. So the answer is yes, there is one. It is next to the manager office, okay? So hagamos tres preguntas basadas en las respuestas que hay aquí y basadas en las palabras que tienen en paréntesis, ¿ok? Let's make it happen, guys. Vamos a hacerlo ahorita mientras termina la clase, please. ¿Tienen questions acerca de esto? Questions, guys? We will do it together right now, ¿ok? Let's do it.
guys, sorry to interrupt you. Voy a pasar la attendance list ahorita, okay? Um, Jessica yeah, well. is not here, right? Jessica, Carla, Elizabeth Escobar. I don't know if you have time to make the 101 session today, Carla. Carla o Kenny, ¿quién puede hacer el 101 ahora? Conmigo, guys. Carla? Kenny, usted puede. No sé si está Kenny acá. Uh, yes, teacher, podría. Sí. Mm, sí podría, pero solo que tengo un detallito que no, no encendería la cámara. No sé si no hay problema. Ah, oh, no, it's fine. It's fine, Kenny. Thank you. Ok, thank you a lot. Ok, uh, so voy a pasar la lista rapidito, guys. Ángel Estefanía Marroquín Martínez. Cristian José López Pérez. Present. Estela Mabel Orellana del Cid. Present, teacher. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present, teacher. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present. Jessica Alca. Jonathan Alexi González Torres. Present, teacher. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Present, teacher. Carla Elizabeth Escobar Esquivel. Present. Kenny Lizeth Cuellar de Barrientos. Present, teacher. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Kevin Alexander. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Linda Magali García Montoya. Present, teacher. Um, Lizeth del Carmen Hernández Miss Smith. Present, teacher. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Eh, Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Marcos Amil Carmancía Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Present teacher. Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Marta Lidia Godínez. Present teacher. Sabrina Lizeth García Orellana. Present. Zulma Yerixa Oliva Córdoba. Present. José Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Yuri Alexandra Flores Parada. Present means. Thank you. Ileana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. Present teacher. Great. Perfect. <clears throat> okay, guys, so we will do something right now. I will ask you with I will ask you the number two. What will be the question in the number two, guys? Are there training rooms in your company? Are there Training rooms in your company, right? Very good. No, there are there are not. Oh uh, no, there are not any. Podemos hacer entonces. Are there any training? No, it's okay. It's okay. Are there training rooms in your company? No, there are not any. We have no training rooms. What about the number four, guys? Good job, Sabrina. Number four. Number four, guys. How can I make this question? Is there a clinic on site? 
Is there a, a side clinic, right? Mm -hmm. A side on site clinic. That's weird. Is there a clinic? Está bien como se lo dijo. Is there a clinic on site? Mm -hmm. No, there is not one. Very good, Amilcar. Number four, guys. Yes, there are five restaurants inside the building. Who wants to help me with this one? Number four. <clears throat> are fun. there mm -hmm. restrooms inside the building? Are there restrooms inside the building? Very good. Yes, there are five restaurants inside the building. Very good. So, uh, guys, very good. Just as a reminder before you go, guys, there are some situations in which you can answer more. For example, on those answers, you don't only say yes, there is, or no, there isn't, or there are, or there aren't, sino que usted me le puede agregar más información dependiendo de la pregunta que le haga, okay? Como por ejemplo estas. Yes, there are five restaurants inside the building. Es como la, la que hizo Marcos. Que usted le agregó más Marcos dependiendo de su respuesta. Ok. So guys, time is over for the class. Sorry that I stole three, min three more minutes from your time. I hope you have an amazing night today. We continue with the class tomorrow. Ok. Have an, an amazing night, guys. Have a good rest. Ok. Take care. See you tomorrow. Bye. Uh, have a good night. Have a good night. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow, Marta. Good night, bye -bye. teacher. Bye. Good night, Fatima. Bye bye. Take care. Okay, let's see. Hello, Kenny, how are you? Hello, teacher, I'm fine, you? How Great. are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you for asking me, Kenny. Thank you a lot for helping me with the one-on-one -on -one session, because I uh, I believe Carla couldn't do it, so that was the reason. So thank you a lot, Kenny. So thankfully, Sorry right to share, now. but uh huh, uh, turn off my camera. Oh, it's fine. It's fine, Kenny. So, uh, Kenny, uh, I would like to ask you if there is something that I can help you today regarding with the class. There is an if there is an extra explanation you need from any topic, extra practice that you really want to have. Maybe if there is anything that I can help you with regarding your learning process, Kenny, I will be more than happy to see you. So please tell me if there is anything that I can help you with, let me know and we will go ahead and, and handle it in this conversation or in this one-on-one -on -one session. Okay, thanks teacher. Um, realmente sí tengo una duda, tengo una duda con un tema, pero es porque realmente estuve de listener, entonces pero fue cuando se tocó el tema de que se hace, que se usan dos verbos en pasado dentro de la oración. Que usamos el did y el, y bueno, algo así vi los ejemplos, ¿verdad? Como que se mezclaban dos verbos y ambos estaban en pasado, creo. No sé si con el auxilio. del tema. No, no recuerdo, pero sí me confundí. que era cuando... las what clauses, tal vez, lo de las cláusulas. Sí, creo que ese es. Ya le verifico. Acá en el... 